Well, I had, um, uh, when I was still at NYU, I, I wrote my second play, full-length play, was called Saturday Night at the War, and it was about the Marine Corps. It was about my experience in the Marine Corps. It was a pretty good play. And uh, Vinette Carroll got a hold of it, and she was uh, a very prominent black New York theater director who had done Arms Too Short to, uh, short to Box With God and Don't Bother Me, I Can't Cope. Uh, and she had a theater that she started called the Urban Arts Corps. And the Ford Foundation had given them money to produce some new plays. And so they asked if they could take my, I did this production of Saturday Night at the War first at, at New York University. They had a 300 seat house. And they asked if they could do it the following season. I said, sure. And so they got this guy, Charles Turner, a, a director, uh, and put him with me and we cast the play and cast it really well. It was ten men and uh, the production was excellent and uh, very small theater and uh, no critics. One critic came and the critic gave it a very good review but uh, it, w it was the only review I got and I didn't realize at the time that when you have a good play and a good production of that play that you can't count on having that very often. And indeed, for me, that was the last time for 10 years that I would have that. Uh, I had productions probably once every 18 months uh, after that, but none of them were right. But this one was right. The director did a great job. The cast was very good. The design was good. The theater was sort of the right kind of vibe for it. Uh, and so, and so that gave me a certain kind of encouragement I'll tell you the thing that gave me the most encouragement. I went with my then wife to see a play at a theater down on Astor Place. And the play had gotten a good review. It was a family play. It was the kind of play that wouldn't survive in New York now at all. But at that time, it was a sort of slice of life play about these people. And it was heartfelt. And it was small. And it was well observed. I went and I saw the play. And I had nothing. I was dead broke and nobody liked me. And uh, I went in and I watched the play. And it came to me while I was watching. I said, I can write better than this. I can. I have no. And I walked outside. And unbeknownst to me, while I'd been in there, it had started to snow. And so when I went in, it was one world. And when I came out, it was another. And, uh, it, and it stayed that world ever since. I knew when I came out that I could do it and that I could that I would do well with it.